Okay. Uh, to show you how to create a FreedomSoft account and set up it for free so you can get access to buyers. Basically, you want to start your free month. You want to put your information in. You want to hit Let's Go. Okay, I'm not going to go through this because I've already done it. But basically, you want to put in your information, uh, a credit card, a uh, credit card that you know maybe you don't use that often. It's not going to charge you, but you know you do have 30 days to make sure you cancel it. But just put something on there that you know you don't mind if uh, you accidentally get charged, but you're not going to. So you do that. You're going to get your login information emailed to you, and then you're going to come back to my.freedomsoft.com and you're going to log in. All right, once you log in, what you want to do, you want to close any quick start, any nonsense right now, okay? I mean, you want to go through FreedomSoft, be my guest, but right now we're trying to get access to cash buyers. Close that, and you want to go to Marketing and Cash Buyers. Click that link. Basically, I have a deal right now I'm working on that's in New York, so we're just going to use that one as an example. Um, New York, it happens to be near Rochester. Okay, so we're going to search that. And it's going to search for you. All right, and then it's going to start populating properties or buyers, excuse me. So here you can see Rochester Redevelopment LLC. They've bought 34 properties. Their last one was on 626,014, and they spent 689,000 on it. Um, you know, et cetera, et cetera, all the way down. And you'll see it found 419 buyers. Okay. Um, and it goes by how many properties they own, uh, you know, their average amount they spent the last time they bought. So you get a lot of good information. Now you want to export that to CSV. Oh, sorry. You want to check all. Okay, so check all and then export to CSV, standard CSV, export. All right, so once it loads or downloads, go ahead and click it. And here are your buyers, first name, last name, their address, and their purchase history. All right, now what you need to do is go through the list. You know, there's 400 of them, so I would go with the most relevant. People are just buying today. Or, you know really really recent okay um, also look at average price based on uh, you know where your property is at I mean there's 419 buyers here and the most the oldest one is 530 I mean so you have multiple options here basically from now what you do is you take the buyers information their address and you send them a letter and in that letter you're going to state, I have a deal at such and such address, uh, cash deal, looking for a cash buyer, blah, blah, blah. I mean, I can, I'm going to do another video uh, on what that should say and how you should do that. But basically, you now have access to 400 buyers in that area. And the only money it's going to cost you is sending them a letter. And that's why, you know, you would want to be more particular with, you know, your, your price point and things like that before you send them a letter. So I'm going to basically go through this list now. I'm going to pick out my buyers that I want to mail to, and I'm going to show you how to do a click-to-mail campaign um, to send these buyers a list. So look for the next video. Cheers.